Hey guys, it's Quaid Quaid here, and today we're doing something a little bit different. So I made this Google form, and it has 50 dumb Cuban questions on it, and I sent it to people on Reddit, Facebook, and Discord. We got one, we got over 150 answers for it, so we're just gonna have a look through what the top answers were for stuff. And I haven't really checked them yet, but I know there's gonna be, I mean, I see people could answer with anything they want, because people could answer serious or jokingly. There's gonna be some inappropriate answers, so there's gonna be a warning at the start here. Uh, if you don't want to see any of that stuff, then... I'm not going to say anything out loud, but if there will be stuff on the screen that might be inappropriate, so uh, you might not want to watch that. So I guess let's get into it. Okay, so as you can see here, we have 162 responses, which is a lot more than I was expecting. I was expecting like 50 or so, but uh, yeah, a lot of people want to do it apparently. So there's 50 questions here. Uh, let's just go through them briefly. So we've got some basic questions at the start, just like normal Cuban questions, but then it goes kind of downhill later on. Uh, who is your favorite Cuba? How long have you been keeping seasons? Are kind of reasonable. What's your favorite event? Uh, what's your best WC event? Like how good you are at it? Uh, this one's what's your favorite Cubing YouTuber? Do you eat while Cubing? This is where it starts getting a bit weird. Do you enjoy the taste of DNM37? And I had to add that because, you know, we can't have people doing that. Uh, what country are you from? I kind of did these ones because people are allowed to laugh. They wanted to do something funny, so... Even if there's just normal questions that might be a bit boring, people can do something funny for them, so we might see some funny answers. Uh, best thing to live a cube with. Can you type your name? Now, this is a meme from the um, Hong Kong Online Speedcubing competition. Uh, when someone said, my name, I cannot type it, it is showing me that it must be a number. So we're basically going to see how many people are either going to randomly click on these, that are, like not knowing what they are, or actually knowing what the meme is. Uh, what was the best competition? The superior method, the ultimate fight. Why is peeling the stickers off the best method? What is your funniest cubing story? How good are you at cubing? This is also one where people can lie a lot, because I don't think anyone would be absolutely horrible, that's probably an exaggeration. And very amazing, I'm not sure about that either. This is, uh, yeah, so some of these answers came from random people on Discord, so this one was not mine, but they wanted to put it on anyway. How do you sub 0 0.5 17 by 17 blind one-handed? How many sides are on a cube? Pretty easy answer there. How do you solve a square one? Someone else wanted that one. So for this one, what is your PB3 by 3 scramble? We're actually going to be trying some of these and seeing how good they are, because why not? Um, I think this one was by Emmett. Why won't my mum let me buy the GAN robot? Does a stickerless cube have stickers on it? What country is the best at cubing? What will the 3 by 3 single on average order goods be by 2050 in 30 years? And how many years can this solve the cube when you do it in competition in time that you solve? Very easy answer there, it's like only one answer you can really do for that. What is the best time for cubing? Obviously at like... 1am. Uh, when was the 3.47 3 3 single world record set? Why was 3 by 3 a feat removed from the WCA? What are your nerves like at competitions? Best way to get a sponsorship? Should we hear some funny answers there? Best WA delegate? Kinda controversial. Uh, which group is the best? So this is, these are Facebook groups, so we have Cubix as friends, Pizza as friends, and 3 by 3 cubers. How many scrambles does a 3 by 3 have? Also, a pretty common answer that you, everyone should know. Take the events to remove from the WCA. So some people did say you shouldn't have to remove any of these, but I mean it's just a fun, people have to remove something. Uh, which event should be added as an event to the WCA? Uh, which universe is the best at cubing? I don't know many universes. What year was Rubik's Cube discovered and not invented? The best cubing Discord server? Just gonna say it's this one right here, KRCA. And we've also got Cubing Nation and R Cubers, two of the big ones I think. But yeah, you can add another one if you want because I'm not sure about what other ones there are really. Who invented the Rubik's Cube? How many subs does the biggest cubing channel have? Kind of a trivia one here. Why use a timer for stacking? Why solve a cube faster when you can solve a cube slower? The big questions right here. Okay, this one is one that I came up with ages ago. It's a really good theory. If you purposely take longer Soviet competitions to be able to compete more, you will get more out of your money. So why would you spend $40 on a competition to compete less? You might as well spend the full cutoff time competing so you can compete as long as you like really can out of that competition. Are uh, your favorite record? How many 3x3 souls do you have in your session? Why is the Tingyun called the Tingyun? I think someone wanted that as well. The best cube manufacturer and store. Who is Felix Index? We really need to know the answer to that one because I'm pretty sure nobody knows. How do I learn full AUF? And ways to solve the cube other than turning it. So those are the 50 questions. Uh, some people found it too long, but uh, 162 responses, that is pretty good, I think. So let's go on question, see the most popular ones here. So yeah, favorite cuber. 12 responses with Felix. So we're gonna get some pretty serious answers, but we might see some funny stuff as well. 
So we've got Felix, then themselves, <laughs> uh, Max Park, Timon Kolosinski, Stanley Chapel, and then me, myself. I'm on here, apparently. I mean, I probably did send this to my friends and stuff. I guess it's reasonable. <laughs> Antonio Cam is on here as well. J Perm. Will Smith. Will Smith. Something's not right here. Kevin Hayes. Felix Index. Spelt wrong. <laughs> Jake Klassen. Matt Volk. Felix Ian. Uh, Rick Astley. Now, there's just one response. So let's go back into questions and see if there's any that are like. Oh, sorry, no. Uh, summary, sorry. Let's see if there's any just randomly on here. Felix Zimd Zimdig. He is so fast. He has why I use Gan cubes. By the way, Gan makes the best cubes. I love Gan and I hate Moyu. Gan lube is the best lube. Thank you for that. Oh, we've got James Macadamia Nut. Very nice. Uh, that, is, that is not a cuba. We've got ZZ as the best method. Mr. Wadek. Hell yeah. I'm on here again. <laughs> Someone who isn't ranked in the top 100 for any event. Who other than the Clockman himself? Yeah, no, Darby is a really good cuba. I agree with that. Okay, <laughs> I guess I guess I'm gonna skip on from that one. So the next question: How long have you been cubing? So the biggest bracket here is this one. Most of people, most of the people here have been cubing for one to two years, apparently. Okay. And the smallest one is this one, I believe. One of these ones. Yeah, this one here. Seven to eight years. So I'd say most of those are probably legit. And then the ones that say 8+, plus, there's a lot here for 8+, plus. I bet a lot of those people are lying saying they did 8+, plus. I'm just going to say that. Okay, next one. What is your favourite WCA event? So yeah, 3x3 three three is going to be the biggest one there, but let's check some other ones, small ones. 6x6. Six six. So people like 7x7 seven seven more than 6x6. Six six. I prefer 6x6 six six in my opinion, but yeah. Yeah, clock's got 11 votes, 6.8%. Probably Ento on this one. And some very small ones down here. Blindfold, 4x4 four four blindfolded, and 2x2 two two, really? I thought 2x2 two two would have a lot more votes actually. So 5 blind, those ones are probably joking as well because I don't think a lot of people on here really have those a favourite event. Also I, I really like the pie chart ones, they actually look cool. And you can see, oh wow this one's tiny, what's that one? Best WCA event, oh your best WCA event, one person voted Mega Minx. This one's also very small, so one person has multi as their best event. So. It's, you can't really tell much from these uh, these stats because you don't know if they're telling the truth or not. But we're, we're going to assume that three by three is uh, people's best events. Okay. Uh, who is your favorite cubing YouTuber? So I can see myself on here already. Um, we're going to go to this one and then have a look. Okay. Top up. <laughs> but, oh wow. So the top four are all JPM just uh, capitalized differently. Yeah, that's a lot of people that like JPM as a favorite YouTuber. You've got Derpy, Tingman, and more JPM. Then I'm on here with three votes as well. Jack Kai, DG, Rules, that's Antonio Cam. Shout out to Antonio Cam. We've got me again, J Perm, me. <laughs> so people people like putting themselves as me for certain cubers, which is weird. <laughs> Crazy by Cuba, and then me, myself, and Pi. Alrighty, very nice. So for, for ones like this, we might look at ones that actually have not just a word, but more actual answers. So the ones that people can actually explain more, like how to do something, like how to solve square one, stuff like that, we're gonna like actually show the answers more rather than, because people are gonna do a lot of different names on these. Okay, next one. Do you eat while cubing? I think Dwayne chose this one, but uh, most people do not eat while cubing. 99 people don't, and 63 people do. So 61, but only, yeah, so 38% of the cubing population, that's, that's a guess. Eat while cubing. I don't know if this means that they always eat while they're cubing, or if it's like sometimes. Okay, th this one. Mo most people, well, just over half of the people haven't tried DNM, but it's kind of worrying that half people are into this are saying that they tried DNM. Don't do this at home, please. Okay, next one. What country are you from? We're going to go back onto this one and see what the most popular answers are. And it is USA for number one, because there are a lot of American cubers out there. Uh, New Zealand will be second because I did send this to a lot of New Zealand people. That's understandable. United States again. So yeah, there's gonna be answers that are spelled differently or like capitalized differently or said differently like this. Um, so it's not overly accurate. The Philippines is up here as well and Canada. Okay. Australia, India, US again. Argentina's got three. Okay. Denmark, Malaysia, NZ again, Bangladesh, Poland, Nepal. Mur Two people said Murica with the exact same spelling. Okay. <laughs> Uh, Costa Rica, Honk Bong, okay, yeah, so let's just scroll down here and see if there's any other ones, someone said Moon, I think, uh, Moon, okay, 
Antarctica. I don't, I don't believe that for some reason. My mom says I can't tell you. Well, I'm sorry about that. The Vatican City, the smallest country in the world. Uh, Dwayne Ramos is a country now. Wouldn't you like to know? <laughs> wow. Uh, apparently Asia is a country as well. New Zealand. Someone here watched Impractical Jokers, I'm pretty sure. I get the reference. Uh, Uranus, very nice, sure. A country, I cannot change it. So yeah, the meme I said before, that's definitely that. Five Star Land. And then Stanley Skakpu is dead. Very nice. Thanks for those answers, guys. Uh, best thing to lube a cube with is the next one. So you've got lube. Oh, okay, I mean, I mean that's not that's not a lie at all. You've got ketchup. That's. I, I wonder how many people have actually tried that. Like, that's probably one of the top things you'd think of that isn't a lube to lube a cube with. I don't really want to try that though. But yeah, it's probably. I actually want to know how that works now. I, I, if anyone has a video of someone doing that, please let me know. So we've got weight 5, it's the first lube that's actually on here that is a lube and not just lube. I've uh, got Trax 50k. That probably is my favourite lube as well. And... Why? Okay, we've got Silk, another lube here. I haven't actually tried Silk, I probably should. Oh, we've got Milk. That would be a really weird lube to use. And two, two people here don't know. Uh, I've got glue. So the next one here. Can you type your name? This is the meme one. So how many people actually got the joke? So the people who said yes and no probably didn't get the joke because they would because if you see the no, if you, if you see the meme at all, you have to say my name. I cannot type it, or it just show me that must be a number. So uh, these people did not get the reference. So around half, I say. Yeah, around uh, around half of people actually got the reference. Just just over half didn't. So. Uh, my name I cannot type it, 29% and it has shown me that it must be a number, 17%. What was the best competition? Again, let's look at the highest options here. Uh, Worlds 2019, that was that was definitely my best competition as well. I can't really compare it to anything else because I haven't really been to, that's the only big comp I've really been to, so I can't really have a say in this. Uh, two people said no, and then I don't know, and never been. So, <laughs> all these people have never been, oh, and this one, never been in a competition. And then World, Worlds 2019 again. World's 1983. Wait, wasn't it 1982? I feel like it was. <laughs> I feel like it was 1982. Hold on, 1982 Worlds. Uh, what's it, Rubik's? That was 90. It was not. <laughs> what? Okay, sure. Oh, here we go. World's 1982. World's 2019. I met Felix. Very nice. So let's look at some of these ones, I guess. Cubing Quarantine 2. Uh, highly recommend that comp. It was really nice. <laughs> no bias there, because I slipped through it. Okay. Welcome Summer Open. That was also a really good comp. The Cuban Club Weekly Comp 2. I I think I won clock on that one. It might be week 2. I'm not sure. So you got some local comps on some of these people, I believe. I'm not sure which ones they are. Your mum. Very nice. It just showed me that it must be a number. So someone just got that meme and put it right under as well. They all suck. Someone that doesn't like competitions, apparently. Assuming they don't like cubing either. Maybe they shouldn't be here. Uh, this person doesn't understand the question at all. This one's just clock. Clock, clock is the uh, best competition. I really liked the war between the Australians and the Emus. Despacito Open 2020. Okay, I, why did I do this? Like, what was I expecting from this? Okay, so everyone who likes CFOP... I mean, most people use CFOP, this is understandable. But everyone who says Rue is better, you're wrong. Okay, no, I'm kidding. I don't really have an opinion. I don't know anything about Rue, so... I mean, it's just that most people do use CFOP. That's literally why there's more good CFOP people, is because there's more people that actually use it. <laughs> so like, I don't really have an opinion on this, but I just wanted to see which one would win. And I was expecting this. Why is peeling the sticks off the best method? So this is one I actually want to look at these ones for in specific. But we're going to see if there's any that are actually the highest vote. I'm not sure if there will be, because that's a pretty hard thing to get the same answer as. And this is short like this. No. It isn't. It's not. LOL. Why? Faster than Rue. Okay, yeah, there's, uh, people are just going from the last one again, just saying that Rue's bad. It's not because stickless is better, I hate stickers. I kill everyone I see a sticker cube. Wow, that's really dark. Damn, okay. Shut up. Okay, that's, that's the end of the video, guys. Thanks for watching, goodbye. Okay, no. Dwayne, Ra Dwayne Ramos, again. Is someone just answering that for all of them? <laughs> because my name, I cannot type it, once again. 
Because if your family does it enough, you can blame the sticker damage on them and force them to buy a new one for you, then ask for whatever cube you want that's expensive. That doesn't seem very nice. You get to snack on the ones that fall off. Yeah, we've, I've really got some questionable ones here. Because it is fun. Is it though? I mean, peeling stickers off is kind of boring, you know? It's just for people who want to solve it. I'll make it look like they solved it. Uh, A. Sure. Lots of tasty residue to snack on. Sure. Okay, what is your funniest cubing story? Again, I won't think there'll be a big option for this. That's an actual story because that'll be having the exact same. It's going to be like no or yes or something like that, I guess. Yeah, no is a top option with seven responses. My name, I cannot type it. So someone's just putting that into all of them, apparently. Two people said this one. I feel like someone entered it twice. I was supposed to record a video of making slow motion Rubik's Cube solve, and in that solve, I already got my PB. That is unfortunate. Haha, <laughs> feel like a good turn with Rubik's Cube puzzle. Some guy posted a survey on, I believe that's Cubing Nation, and I open it and answer questions. I did see Fop and realize that rule existed. Helium Wadic. Please no. We missed Wadic Cube for 24 hours. That was a good video, link in description. I see Felix Zerum Digs eat lemon. I don't see what's funny about that, but when you type it, it's kind of funny. I dropped an egg. Are, are these cubing stories? I'm not even sure. One time I asked Will Smith if he knew how to solve it, and he just headbutted me. Yeah, I, I don't think I believe some of these. One time I almost got a PR, but then I didn't because it was over two minutes off. Is that almost PR? And this is like multi. No, multi doesn't even have time. It's like five blind or something. <laughs> Once an organizer got banned from keeping inscription money and not giving it back. So the next one here, how good are you at cubing? So we don't really need to go on the other one for this. So most people actually chose one. And when I when I say people could choose anything they want, I guess that's expected that people would say they're bad. And then I, I knew it would be one of these two, so people are saying they're bad. It's around the same amount of people are saying that they're the worst and the same amount of people are saying they're the best. We got only three votes from nine. That's weird. <laughs> and it's kind of in the middle for the rest of them. How do you sub 0.5 17 by 17 blind OH? And let's look at the top responses for this. Get good. Yes, you don't. One. Practice. Yes. Don't have enough money. Zeroing. Six. Lube your blindfold with milk. Hmm. That doesn't sound right. Alright, the next one. How many sides are on a cube? I am expecting six to be the highest one for this. And yeah, 58 people said 6, so there's a lot of people that were serious on this one, and it was a really obvious answer. Number 2 is 69, of course. Expected that. 7, 9, 4, 21. Too many. That is true. How do you solve a square one? This is, this is one of the ones I kind of want to see the actual answers for. You don't. I don't know. Yes, I don't know. Yes, with your hands. Beginner's method. What is the actual beginner's method on square one? Like, I know what it is. I still don't know what you call it. I think it's just called Beginner's Method. I don't think it actually has a name. We've got a video here. I'm not sure what this is, but we can just cut it out if it is something dumb. Or is this a Square One tutorial? Hey, it's a Square One tutorial. Video, it's this DG Cube Square One tutorial. Very nice. Thanks for that. Just keep turning randomly and you'll get there. I mean, eventually you will, but like, Square One, that's, that's gonna take a while. So I'm gonna turn on the camera for this one. I'm gonna try some random 3x3 scrambles in time then. Let's just see how I do on them. So I'm not warmed up right now because I am recording this video, so I, I probably won't do too well. But the top options were, just R. This one is absolutely nothing somehow. Okay. I don't know, U prime, no. Alrighty. So we're just going to go into these, and let's try some of these ones right here. Some of the actual ones. We've also got, you are dumb. Very nice. So let's try this one here. What happened? <laughs> what even happened there? That was a 27, I don't know what happened. I mulled up and that. Uh, I stuffed everything up on that one. I've got another one right here, let's try this one. Yeah, 13.2, not warmed up at all. This one here. This one's got a cross piece and a pair right here, so I'm not sure what I can do with this. I can't really insert that too well. Actually, I might be able to. I 
I did that all wrong. 16.98. I'm not. I need to. I need to warm up. I definitely need to. Okay, let's try this on here. That one should have been sub 10, but I had a bit of a weird ending there. 11.4 on that one. Not great either. Okay, let's try one more. So, how about this one? Fourteen point three. I'm not happy with any of those. Uh, yeah, let me know what times you get in the description, I guess. All right. So after those pitiful attempts, I guess let's move on. I don't know. I don't even have a normal magnetic cube or magnetic cube. My name, I cannot type it. I don't know. Those are the top answers. Very, very nice. Because I bought all of them. They are out of stock now. Lol, lol get drove. She knows what's best for you in your future. <laughs> Thanks, mum. Robots can kill you, because your mother is smart because she hates you. But these two are very different. Because of what I did in 1992, I don't know what this means. Because robots cheating at those moves before it's solving. Isn't that what ev everyone knows before they're solving? Since it's called inspection. It's bad and dumb. They really don't like the game robot. Haha <laughs> noob, that, that is not answering the question. Because you shouldn't be able to beat Fez. I'm pretty sure Fez can beat the robot. I think someone made a video on beating it. Your mom is saving you from Gan's sinister plans. Also true. Antonio can Gan. I, I'm pretty sure he can. We don't need these government controlled spy machines in these households, young man. Okay, let's move on from that one. Uh, does a stickless cube have stickers on it? Most people say that it does, and that is a correct option. What country is the best at cubing? I'm gonna just say it's gonna be USA, as a top option. Because they probably are. <laughs> yeah. Uh, USA have 12, then Australia. Poland, that's also another option because of like pyramids and skew and stuff, I guess. And turn on for 3x3. Germany, India, USA, Earth. I wonder how many Kiwis are going to say New Zealand, because I am expecting that too. China, USA, and Australia. America, Africa, that's a continent. <laughs> Antarctica, also a continent. USA, uh, Democratic Republic of the Congo. USA, because Stanley Chapel. Got some New Zealand here. This one's mocking it, I think. <laughs> um, New Zealand says there's a best NR streak. I think that means we're bad because we can't get good records that can't be broken, really. <laughs> My country. Which one is that, though? Alright, let's move on. What will the 3x3 single and average world records be in 2050? 0.69, okay. Again, I don't know what I was expecting from this at all. Probably sub 3 and sub 5 average. Okay. 1. Just one. Keeping what we did by then, there's also a, a valid option here. WCA will have fallen, that sounds way more serious than it should. Single, Euro Mom average, 0.69, la la la. 3.47 single, and Mr. Wadic average will have been removed to do it, being too luck based. <laughs> the WCA won't exist, yeah, I, I mean, I don't know if Keeping will still be a thing in 2050, you never know, but I can see how people are saying it won't exist. Sniggle 3.18, average 4.62. Probably negative. Hmm. I'm not a time traveler. I mean, I did say what will it be, not what do you think it will be. I guess that's fair. Humanity will cease to exist in 2021. That is very, very close. The WC in 2031. Alright, next one. How many years can this solve the cube when you do it in competition in time that you solve? So there's only one valid option for this. And the answer is whatever the top one is. Yes, that, that is the correct option. Why would you answer anything else except yes? It's clearly. And how many years can this solve the cube when you do it in competition in time that you solve? It is yes. The seven people who didn't understand the question at all, because that's put a question mark. What? What? <laughs> uh, yeah, they, they, <laughs> you've got another what here. What? A lot of people don't understand it. Question mark, what, 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 what? 42? That's not, that's not, that's not the right answer. Uh, what? <laughs> Everyone, nobody knows. R slash I had a stroke. Uh, subreddit's nice. My name I cannot type it. Solve the cube in the time that you solve the cubing solving cube. Someone gets it. <laughs> These words have meaning on their own, but together you somehow have discovered something new. A secret which if revelated will remove all knowledge of two other dogs. How to solve a clock. All three other verses but Petrus. And it will come to three style. I don't understand the question. Nice. I'm discombobulated by the question at hand. Could you please rephrase your inquiry so that I can give an answer that's sufficient to it if I'm being asked? Are you having a strong? <laughs> Maybe. What if, there were, what if there were friendly bees the size of dogs? I want that. 
That would, that would still be scary, like... It's just coming up with dogs dressed as bears. This is not what I wanted. What is the best time for cubing? So the highest option here. 4.20 a.m. Also expected that. And then it's midnight. And then it is 6.09 a.m. Also expected that. And then we've got 3 a.m. That's the most valid time for cubing. And tied in the fifth place, we've got 1 a.m. and 11 a.m. This is not a good option at all. Because that is a time that I'm supposed to be off. When is a 3.47 3 by 3 record set? Uh, three people said the 1st of January 1901. Not sure why three people said that. And this was the actual date it was set, so I'm guessing some people actually looked it up. Uh, yeah, the 24th of November 2018. Some people thought it was on the other side of that as well. It's probably was the 28th as well. Alright. We've got some way far in the future. Uh, we've got 420. 6969 and then we've got 696969. Six, nine, six, nine. Uh, well, I definitely expected all these, but I really didn't at the same time. Why will Steve Arthur have food removed from the WCA? What are the top options here? I don't know. Yes. Because of the odor of your feet. Too many people lick them. Okay, no, this is. I knew there'd be, there's gonna be dumb stuff, but not this much. Because the delegates liked feet, but they didn't want the competitors to find out. Because ooh feet stinky gross. Because they were too lazy to organize it. Because Mr. Cam did not do a good job as the WC stuff him, but he could have saved it. Because of Spectacle Guy, I forgot his name. Hmm. It was either that or chopping off people's feet. That is very scary to think about. Because the WCA board wanted to remove it. That is also that is that is a true option, but this seems very obvious. <laughs> what are your nerves like at competition? So top answer is bad. Yeah, I'm expecting all of these to be like, yes, no, I don't know, stuff like that. It's one word answers that are really short, because no one's going to say the same thing if it's an actual answer, really. So we've got bad, I don't know, fine, never been. Uh, not yet in the competition. Time, time slows down, bro. They'd be better if I skydived. It is composed of neurons, also known as nerve cells, which receive and transmit impulses and... Neuroglia, also known as glial cells or glia, which assist the propagation of the nerve impulse as well as provide nutrients to the neurons. Nervous tissue is made up of different types of neurons, or whichever next on. Very nice. Nerves like Daniel Carmack and Wells are not solving for one to two minutes of awkward silence. That was great. Everyone's complaining about how long it was taking in uh, squad finals. Not Dwayne Ramos. Does that mean it's you have a lot of nerves? Because Dwayne gets like... I mean, he gets nerves, but he doesn't do that bad with them anyway. Imagine the whole earth relies on you getting a good solve, except in Pura, I don't care about Pura. They go... Whoa, whoa. <laughs> they bully me? The nerves bully you at competitions, that is very sad. Caramel flavoured. Yum. Okay, what's the best way to get a sponsorship? And the top options will probably be short as well. Get good, be fast. Ask and beg. <laughs> Money? Just pay, just pay them to sponsor you, I don't... I think that would work. YouTube, I mean, that's that's fair, I guess. Be good, be good again. Get a record, eat a cube, make your own company. Be someone that has a sponsorship, also true. Spam the company's Instagram DMs and then get blocked. I mean, a lot of people have probably done that, honestly. Like, there are a lot of people that, like, ask shots to be sponsored, and no one knows who they are. Uh, just a, just a quick tip here, don't do that. Do not recommend doing this one. Please, please don't do that. First, if you're a child, you're out, so it's 99.99% of cubes. I'm pretty sure that many aren't children, like... I mean, there's lots of people are sponsored, like, um... People, people generally over the age of, like, 13 are sponsored a lot. And there are people, like, younger than, like, Leo Bromero and stuff, and Sean, um, Villanova, I think. So, that's not accurate, but it does. Next cube for 10 plus years. That means you need a 2010 idea or less. Lots, most of the sponsor people, like, ever wouldn't, like, in cubing, wouldn't have that. <laughs> probably mostly, like, 2016, 2015, 2014, somewhere like that, most of them, probably. This leaves a handful of people, so your choice is a good then. That is a lot of requirements, and those are both, I mean, yeah, they're both really hard. Spam fool you with can I get sponsored message. Again, I don't recommend doing this. Best WCA delegate. This is a controversial one, let's see what it's gonna be. I don't know. And we've got Keaton Ellis. Me. Erno Rubik is the best delegate, apparently. Thecubicle.com. No one, no one. Uh, Kit Clement. 
I don't know who this guy is. I've heard of him, I think. Hi, right, Hollingdale. Your mom. Okay. Alex Esbury. Got some more Keaton Ellis down here. Antonio Cam, obviously the best delegate. Dwayne Yay Yay Yane, also the best delegate. Liam Waddock, JK James, because why not? Did I just get rejected like that? The best WCA delegate. That is also true. I mean, that makes sense. Your mom. Which group is the best? So, Facebook group. Most people chose 3 by 3 cubers. So, we've got 3 by 3 cubers, like half of the people. We've got Cubics as friends and then Pete's as friends. So, I'm pretty sure Cubics as friends is like a bunch of cube members who talk about cubing. Pete's as friends is a bunch of cube members who don't talk about cubing, but more like only politics. How many scrambles does a 3 by 3 have? Let's look at some of the top answers here. We have got 43 quintillion and then 43 quintillion again. But this is an actual number form. So, this is the correct answers. Uh, 43, like j just 43. <laughs> We've got 2, 1, 9, 4, at least 7. A lot. 43 quinth B of the Philian. 43.69 quintillion. How if I know? <laughs> this, <laughs> they don't want to know anyway. 98 million, pretty close. It has shown me that it must be a number. I mean, this is a number. I I'm, not, I'm not even going to try and read these ones here. That's a lot more than there actually are. <laughs> okay, this is a fun one. Tick the events that should be removed from the WCA. 100 people said clock. Very, very sad. <laughs> okay, so the least voted one's FMC, actually. That's weird. So, quite a few people want to also remove Skew. Also quite strange, actually. I thought it'd be like 5 blind or something. Then we've got, I think, uh, yeah, 7x7 seven seven and 5 blind. Okay, which event should be added as a WCA event? Let's look back on the question here. Most people want to add feet. <laughs> Surprising, people want to add feet back to the WCA. I don't know if that's ever going to happen. Like, if people, if a lot of people want to, I don't know if they're actually going to add it back. Uh, none, that's also another option that people would definitely choose. That's reasonable. Kellerminx is probably one of the most uh, voted events to be added, I think. And probably if I had to add an event, it would be that as well. People want to add Magic Bat. Okay, uh, three by three of feet again. Face turning octahedron, I think. None. Kettle makes a ready cube. Mirror blocks, mirror cube. Seventeen by seventeen. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna happen. Clock blind. None. We have too many already. I don't know if we have too many events. I'd say. I mean, it's fun having more, but I, I can see why you think we have too many. Clock with belly buttons. Ultimate frisbee except with clock. <laughs> Eating butter. Was it um? Mike Boynowski that did something like that. I think it was. Which universe is the best at cubing? Top answer is mine. And then ours. And then Earth. So the top three are literally all our universe. You never know. If there's infinite parallel universes, then we are not the best at cubing because there will be one that has fast people because we do not have 0, 0.00 or anything. If there's, par if there's infinite parallel universes, there will be one that has 0, 0.00. Or 0 0.01, whatever. Uh, ours, this one, yes, uni Universe 7. Not this one. <laughs> that one. Marvel, MCU, yes, lol. The other one. Felix Zimdix. Sure. <laughs> Antarctica is a universe. Juicy Way is better than Milky Way. Rue is better than CFOP. These are great universes, guys. One where cubing is your eyes. I don't know what this means, but I want to. New Zealand is a universe, apparently, and we're not even the best country, so, sure. Okay, what year was the Rubik's Cube discovered? 1, just 1 AD is when the Rubik's Cube was discovered, very nice. 1974, I believe that was the invented date, not discovery date. 1980 was the third option, that's when it was discovered. Uh, Rubik's Cube was discovered in 1492. Not sure why I said so many responses, but okay. 2020, cubing was discovered this year. 1982, tw next year, sure. 72, 2016, 1969, 2, 0 0.1. Okay, I I'm, I'm done here. Best cubing Discord server, so a lot of people add options, and a lot of people chose to add options, so. We've got, uh, the biggest one is r slash cubers, probably the biggest cubing chat, I believe. Uh, then cubing nation, oh no, sorry, uh, KICA in second place. That's just, that's the New Zealand Discord, so only for New Zealand people, and a few selected non-kiwis in it. Uh, cubing nation is here as well, and they've got a bunch of options here. So let's look at some of these. 
RMS, I think it's Room Method Speed, uh, room method speed Solvers or something. I think. So that's the NZ Cuba. Uh, definitely a not dead server there. Keeping it home. Facebook Messenger. No Discord. <laughs> there was one here that said, None they all suck. Thanks for that. Cringy teens making rubric memes. Is that an extra one? That sounds like one, honestly. Nope. No skills and cubes? That is a great one. I'm an admin on that one. Okay, alright. Who invented the Rubik's Cube? So, as you can see at the start, there's a lot of Erno Rubik, so we're gonna see that. <laughs> probably is number one. So, we'll see that's number one, probably. Erno Rubik is, yeah, 29 responses in five. So, we'll simply choose that one. Then, me. Erno Rubik, Rubik, Erno Rubik, Erno, Erno Rubik, actually spot right. <laughs> the, the guy who invented Ru, I don't know how to pronounce his name, but. Don't think he invented the cube, but. He clearly didn't invent anything important anyway. No, I'm, I'm kidding, that, that was a joke. Um, Felix Index, me, Professor Anna Rubik, Jesus, <laughs> uh, Aliens, J. Pim is biased, Alamo Rubik, <laughs> Alamo, Felix Zimdog, Felix Zimdig, it's how he is so fast, Erno Rubik slash Lemotic, so me and Erno did a collaboration of inventing the Rubik's Cube. We've also got Jasper Murray in here, okay. We've got Dwayne, spelt wrong. Erno of two funny looking dots above the O Rubik. We've got Ben Baron, or as uh, Anto says, Ben Baron. No one, it always existed. That is true from one of the other questions that we had here. Uh, what year was it discovered? Because it was not invented. So this is a trick question, it says who invented it, but it was literally this Earth that invented it. Because it just happened to exist. Er oh, this one's broken. Erno Rubik, is that- that's not even a TN, that's just some random lines. Alright. How many subs does the biggest cubing channel have? Let's look at this one. Alright, top option is three, and then two, and then one. Nice, three, two, one. Uh, one million. I don't know. I don't know squad back here again. Over a million, 1.27 million. Is that true? Okay, I thought it was less. 400k, a lot, a lot. There's just some normal answer. PewDiePie. It's currently growing, so by the time I answer this, my answer is wrong. That is probably true. Zero, I don't think any big cubing channels owns a submarine. Wow, funny joke. Not my business. <laughs> I mean, if it's public, it kind of is. About the same number as the number of questions in this freakishly long survey. T Series sucks, it's a whole company versus one guy called Felix. Arvid Elf Shell. <laughs> so it's PewDiePie, and he has over a billion subs, that's what I'm gonna say. Uh, I don't know why I'm caps lol. Thanks for that, I, need, I definitely needed that. That's That was the correct answer. Okay, why use a timer for stacking? Top one I'm gonna guess is, I don't know. I'm just gonna say that. No, and then I don't know. Oh, they're tied. So basically the same thing. These two add together for nine, so yeah, yeah. I don't know between the biggest one here. Why not? I use phone timer, twisty timer. Okay, that's not that's not the question. To time the stacking, duh. PP small you. If you get a bigger bed for your bedroom, you have less space in your bedroom and more space for sleeping in your smaller bedroom. Anyway, stacking is dumb. <laughs> that had nothing to do- I thought it was gonna have something to do with it, but apparently not. What is stacking? Never heard of it. <laughs> Cause you're an uninformed little kid. Wow. Because you stack your brains. Haha, <laughs> time ago, bro. <laughs> Cause stacking sucks unless you're Max Park and you stack. I mean, that seems really biased. <laughs> that only one person is allowed to not suck at stacking. Stacking is a dumb sport, why do people find it fun to stack damn cups? Because they're easy to stack. Okay, the big questions here. Why solve a cube faster when you can solve a cube slower? Top answer, I don't know. Oh yes, and then I don't know. Also tired. Fast. I am speed. Because, why not? A. Okay, let's look at some of these ones. To impress ladies and lose some rice purity points. Because gotta go fast. You know what, that's a good idea. There we go, we made someone just completely ruin their comp. Yay. Because French eats snails. I'm not sure that's worth anything in this. <laughs> because you can solve more faster instead of less slower. Wow, Shakespeare. <laughs> if you purposely take longer solving at competitions to be able to compete more, you'll get more out of your money. Most people agree with that, but it's, around, it's only around half, but the majority do agree with that. Everyone at your next competition, spend 10 minutes on their 3x3 average. On each solve. Actually, uh, please don't do that. <laughs> you can get disqualified for that, please don't. Favorite record, let's see this one. So we have 
probably the world record for something. It was 708. I don't know. Oh, is that, is that Eric Akers like? On the 3x3 one? I'm pretty sure it is. Then 4.73, the long lasting 3x3 world record from Felix. 566, I don't remember which one that is. Uh, we've got the Beatles as a rig. Oh, a record. I think, I I'm assuming that's what it is. PB average, that is also fair, I guess. Because that is still a record. 0 0.01, 1 by 1 single by Xiaolun. Nice. 3.74, that's not accurate. <laughs> Alright, let's look at some of these ones. Ben Baron UWR, that is a cool record. The current clock OCR average of 5 solves from Darby Lee himself. Mr. Wodic 7.24 clonk. Clearly the worst record, you know. Most of DNM 37 eaten in 2 minutes. Derpy's 3 sniggle for square 1 that he got on the stream. C418 cat. Minecraft music disc. My North American record. Don't know who this is or what it is, but good job. Felix 4.73 just as my SD card runs out. Shout out to Emmett, I think that was him. Liam Waddick's 7.28 clock in uh, I don't, I don't think that one actually happened, you know. I don't think I got a record like that. How many 3 by 3 solves do you have in your session? Let's see how many people... Uh, I'm gonna... Okay, I wanna try and guess this. I mean, people probably say none or zero. Or I don't know. Maybe yes. Okay, yeah, zero. Uh, I should've expected this one as well. 69. Yeah, all the number ones are gonna have that. Two, 131. Negative one. Hmm. 4,000, 3,000. A lot. <laughs> Negative four. 9,637 for just 2020. That is a lot of hard work for that. 147 mine got deleted. That's unfortunate. 3,935 as of 1905, 28th of May, 2020. Australian time, I think. That is very specific. 100,485 so I lead the past one. That is a lot. 100,000 three right yourselves. I had about 30,000 in an app and I deleted it. This is really sad, a lot of people have deleted their times. Why is a Tingun called the Tingun? So, my idea of what number one would be, probably I don't know, or yes. Yep, I don't know. Then we've got, then we've got yes. <laughs> wow, okay. Because, I don't know. I don't know, China, okay. I mean, that, that's technically true because the Chinese, uh, wait, what company is Tingun's? YJ? I think it's YJ. I think YJ is Chinese. So yes, so technically it's true. They didn't name the Tingyun. Because Tingyun. 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 Why not? Dot. Don't know. Because... Oh, is oh, it Dian? Sorry. <laughs> it is Dian. Not YJ. Um, yeah, they're Chinese as well anyway. Why is anything called anything? That's deep. Very, very deep. Because Mr. Tingyun wanted his kid to be called Tingyun. Just like... That's how the, that's how the Hayes 7 was named, you know? Mr. Hayes wanted to be called the Hayes. Okay, we've got the best cube manufacturer. There's a lot of options right here that there could be. And I can see a lot of ones are the same, so... I'm gonna say Moyu or Gan is gonna be number one. Like, definitely. Yeah, Moyu and then Gan. Moyu, Gan, Moyu, Chi, Diane, Gan, Chi, Gan, V-Cube. V-Cube! <laughs> oh, why? Yeah, there's obviously gonna be some fake answers here. Moyu, YG, me. Rubik's, Rubik's, Rubik's. G, Y, J, S, G, and Rubik's. McDonald's, that is a great answer. We've got Rubik's down here. Awesome. Cadbury, <laughs> okay. WTF, there's more than one cube manufacturer. Gan, haha, my sub is a 40. Your mom, always on there. My uncle, Kevin Hayes. Australia, Texas, probably a robot of some sort. Your mom again. And then another, another your mom. We're getting a lot of these, aren't we? Nuns doing the tango. <laughs> what does this mean? All right, so let's move on to the best cube store. So let's see the highest options here. Okay, so number one is the cubicle. Kind of expected that since they're probably the biggest cube shop. Uh, number two is Speaker to Code on Z. Speaking of that, this video is sponsored by Speaker to Code on Z. Link is in the description. All right, they've got Speaker Cube Shop. Speaker Shop again. The cubicle, the cubicle, Walmart. Cubes UK, Cubes UK. The cubicle again. A lot of the cubicle will be this spelled differently. And speak cube shop actually. The cubicle.com, the cubicle.com, the cubicle.com. <laughs> speak to code on Z, speak to code on Z. Very good answers right there. The supermarket to buy some well performing chocolate with excellent corner cutting. Your mum, once again, is on here. Speedcube.co.new Zealand. Cubesmith. Well, that's an old shop actually, yeah. 
I, I wasn't really kidding then. The one that I'm sponsored by. <laughs> Alright. Who is Felix Index? We need the answer to this one. Who is Felix Index? He is me. So we got Felix and two of his clones on here and answered they answer this question, so they're, they're me. The greatest of all time at cubing. Also very true. Uh two people don't know. God, also true. Cuba, also again that's true. Who? My friend, a god, my dad. So Felix has at least two sons, so that's what we can gather from this. The buff dude that picked up when I called my girlfriend. <laughs> Matt's his husband. Alright then. Okay, how do I learn full AUF? Let's see the answer to this one. Uh, it's practice. That's the, that's the answer, it's practice AUF. I don't know, you don't. Because who knows, like the whole AUF, like all 10 sets of AUF is... 50 of each one, that's a lot of AUF to learn. You? I mean, that is true, you just need to do U moves. Practice in two side parallel recognition. You don't. Practice, I don't know. Automation flying units. Are you flipping kidding me? How to not know how to AUF you failure? And a disappointment, you suck like the day you were born. Stop trying to learn, you seizure inducing man. Wow, that's, just, that, that's sad. This isn't funny, delete this question. Hey, at least I didn't come up with it anyway. The Gan robot has some saw dogs, we have to get off your lazy ass and still love if you're gonna be able to afford it. Well, with a full finger. You learn full AUF. I don't know, man, I'm still getting there. And is this another video on how to learn full AUF, or is it like a rig roll or something? You never know, I kinda wanna go on these though, it's kinda fun. And it is. I like cubing. The and your approach to PLL and AUF. Have all the same tutorials on this stuff. So now we've reached a final one, this has been a while. Ways to solve the cube other than turning it. So, top answer will probably be I don't know or yes. Oh no it's not, peel the stickers off. Okay, that's, I felt like that was too long to actually like have the top answer. Then no. <laughs> Twist it, peel off the stickers, peeling the stickers off. Peeling off stickers, take piece out and reassembling, peel the stickers off. Yeah, there'll be a lot of these. Painting the cube, that's, <laughs> that's new I guess. Have a friend do it. They, I mean, they're still turning it, but I guess I did say... No, I said what's the way to solve the cube other than turning it, not you turning it, so... Technically, it's still not right. Eating it? Will that solve it, though? Maybe. Uwu. <laughs> yes. Smash it on the ground and fix it. Okay, let's see some actual, like, proper answers here. You're stupid, you can only solve it by turning it. Incorrect. Ramos. <laughs> Eating with cereals. Buy a new cube. I mean, that's kind of the only way you can, I mean, it's already solved, so you're not solving it. Eat the cube, yummy, scrumptious, mm, mm oh yeah, yummy, tasty cube, yum, 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 in my tum, I love the taste of 3x3, I want to dine on the yum, yum, yummy 3x3. <sighs> you don't, you don't, lol, I don't know how many plays I'm gonna die and why 50 questions help. <laughs> so it's been really, really fun, uh, thank you to everyone who entered the form, and thank you guys for watching, goodbye everyone.